Welcome back to our final clip of Ground Zero and in this segment, we review an article sent in by Stomper Isaac who talks about Miss Singapore Universe, Rachel Hum, who has made headlines again. This time for admitting that she went for breast enhancement surgery in Singapore. Hmm. As a former pageant contestant yourself, mm. you know, what do you think? Mm. Well, I didn't know such things were even allowed. Well, actually, no. I think <laughs> I did. But I didn't try them. So, um, I... Mm, I don't think it's actually wrong at all. Because... There's no rule, hard and fast rule. There are lots of people in Brazil and Venezuela and Chile who do it all the time. There are these Brazilian beauty boot camps that actually send them for training from some young age and they do everything from top to toe. And they win the pageants all the time. You know, Venezuela, Chile and all that. They're always in the top 5 to 10 of all the beauty pageants. So, I don't know. But this is Singapore, you know? So, it's like, <laughs> if our Singapore women you know, feel the need to actually look better and that gives them a boost of self-confidence. <laughs> um, you know, I think it's perfectly normal and perfectly okay and Rachel does look better after she did her surgery. In this contribution, the cheeky stomper even sent in pictures of the beauty queen before and after she went for surgery. And look at the comparison between the two. It is quite a big difference, isn't it? Yeah, so do you think it's controversial that, you know, a local beauty queen has had enhancements? Because most people here think it's only for porn queen. Oh, come on, no way. And like, it, it totally isn't true at all. How can boob, you know, like, just make you a porn queen? I've seen a lot of models who a lot of people actually don't know have had big jobs and they weren't blown up or anything. It's just that someone found out about her. And she has been a, having a bad run of luck, huh? all the things being exposed. And she looks good. So Rachel, you look good. Let me that. Some comments from our stompers have showed that they are much more cynical about this issue, like sugary pie. She mm. said that this kind of thing is very common nowadays. You know, many free people actually have plastic surgery. How many girls look pretty without plastic surgery and makeup? Actually agreeing with you. Mm. Well, friend Japani disagreed. She said beauty queen should be a natural born beauty and not one that artificially enhanced plastic jobs. The organizer should ban all plastic surgery to take part. No eyelash extension, no fake boobs, no fake hair, etc, etc. What's the point of competing if all are man-made and looks almost the same and unrecognizable without makeup? <laughs> well, okay, think about it, all the Korean stars do at least one day. So, I mean, <laughs> we're becoming a society plastic. Oh, come on, would you do any? I don't know yet. <laughs> I'm still young. <laughs> well, that's all we have for you at Ground Zero. Until next time, keep, keep on, on stomping. stomping.